Hey, 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 y'all. What is happening? Welcome to my channel, T Girl Magic Tarot. Yeah, yeah. Here to do a reading for my ch ch Gemini. My Gemini. What's going on, Gemini High Vibe Cross Watcher? I hope everybody is doing well, and I'm sending you so much love, healing, light, and energy. <laughs> Um, keep in mind it's a general message. It will not resonate with everybody, nobody, somebody, we don't know. But take what fits for you, and you already know what to do. Choir, come to the front, and I want to thank you. Thank you, each and every one of you, for all your love, your subscribes, your donations, your support, your kind words, and your email. Like everything, Gemini, High Vibe, Cross Watchers, everybody, I love you. Um... <clears throat> One, two, three, oh, T Girl, T Girl, Magic and Collective. T Girl, T Girl, T Girl, Magic and Collective. T Girl, T Girl, Magic and Collective. Check us out and see what we're about. Ooh, we are Gemini, 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 Gemini. We sing Gemini, 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 Gemini. Gemini, we are Gemini, 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 Gemini. I'm glad I'm laughing. Yay, choir. Yes. Because literally this I just woke up. You know, you guys know how I do it. I roll out of bed and then I start recording for Gemini. And you get the morning throat or not. Okay. But anyway, let's see what's going on. The ancestors, Holy Spirit, Ascended Masters, they want us to get the tea because there clearly is some tea going out, going on. And whatever the tea is, honey, it is out of this world. Yeah, I heard that little chirp chirp in the background. So what's going on with the tea spirit? What's out of, ooh, somebody, you're my little secret. And that's how we should, who is in here? Child, is somebody, wait a minute. Oh, my God. Wait a minute. Okay, I don't know what this is. This is nothing. I don't know. Is this going on in the world, Spirit? Did somebody get up? I don't know. Somebody got caught up. Somebody's lover, jealous lover, the cape child. That's why it's dangerous. And make sure that you be knowing who the fuck is around your surroundings and circles because you don't know who is who and what is what is looking at around you. Somebody done found somebody. I don't know what this is. I don't know what this is. This might resonate with somebody, so I'm being pushed to say it. Somebody caught their lover. Somebody got unalive. Somebody, uh, somebody, oh, they was trying to control child. They got caught somebody in the bed with their lover from having an affair. Child, somebody got chained up. Somebody got home. Child, what is going on? They was watching you from afar. <laughs> or whoever these energies were that were cheating. This person was watching you from afar. This person's a little cray cray. They don't have all their marbles. They're they're like, oh my god, and honey, they trying to control you. And honey, mm, I don't know. Somebody is going. What is going on, spirit? What is going on in this tea? I don't know who's going to pick this up. Somebody's being you, child. They saw you. You were exposed when they saw you in the bedroom giving sweet nothings, and this man licking on your neck, or him lick, or her licking on your neck. Child, some of them was in the room. They came in your house and saw you from afar, but you didn't even realize that motherfucking shit. Now they salty. Some of y'all, who is this? No offense to nobody. This could be any race, though, because all the races is crazy, to be honest with you. Okay, ain't no race better than Nan, nobody else. That's for real. Um, But I am getting Caucasian. <laughs> no offense, my babies, Okay. But those are the ones that are like, take you on the boat trip, the boat ride, everything's fine, I love you, let's go on a helicopter ride or whatever, and then they unalive you and throw you into the ocean somewhere, and you thought everything was cool, because y'all went out to dinner and he bought you an outfit, and every, I'm telling you, this is that type of energy that I'm getting, who does, in the hell is in here, okay, this could be future energy coming, Getting this could be a warning, God seeing everything, and he's ahead of your time. God is ahead of your time. He's behind the time. He's in the time. So whatever time this is, God sees whatever this is going on. Girl, somebody about to get caught up and chained up with a lover and motherfucking Sodoma. Ooh, child, Lord have mercy. Because you, 
Divine Feminine, this is for you. I don't think this is about Divine Feminine. Divine Feminine. Child, you being set up. Whoever this lover is, it's going to cause a burning. Whoever you about to have this love affair with. Child, I don't know what's going on. Spirit, what is this? Y'all only can know. I don't know. I kind of want to get out. Yeah, you're a diva. Whoever you are, you're a diva. Divine Feminine. Yeah, YOLO. You only live once. You want to live your life and everything. But um, this person is getting ready to take a risk. You're getting ready to take a risk on this love fairy. Because you're like, I only live once. So you probably think whoever... Oh my God, please, Jesus. Don't be led to the slaughter. Look. Oh, Lord have mercy. Oh my God, you're in too deep now, whoever you are. Because you got this crazy ass spouse. Child, you got this man or woman with these behavior issues after your ass. Oh, my God. Because they was holding you hostage in this relationship. Or that your relationship when you was with the crazy person. And they are burnt out now. Or you're burnt out of the relationship. And you want to go move to this new person. Because you're trying to strategize another outlook to get with this energy. Because this is who you love. But whoever you left, this crazy person... Child, they are spying and lurking and looking. At, child, they try, ooh, honey, they got blood in their mouth and on their hands, and they sending you and the person you in love with the evil eye. Some of them probably broke in your home, forcible entry right here at nighttime. You didn't even know. Oh my God, oh, who is this? Y'all be careful in them streets. I don't know. Maybe you was cleaning up and something exploded in your kitchen, and that was that karmic. Something happened. If you had any vandalism or any explosions or any, somebody ran through your house or if you had something going great. Yeah. And whoever you're, whoever you're dealing with, divine feminine, because I feel this is a masculine who has a crazy ass karmic on his tail who is hostile. Child and she and y'all been exposed. Or maybe he exposed the truth like nobody can captivate this man like you. And she like, what did you just say? And she lost it. Like this person don't have all the marbles up there. It's all over divine feminine. You could be interracial, different race, culture, whatever the case may be. Okay, divine feminine. She's trying to. So let me see what's going on. This mama's boy is trying to come back to financially use you. They were somebody that left you abandoned and for dead. So whoever this masculine is that left you divine feminine, that they got this crazy ass karmic, you don't even want this divine masculine. Uh, he's not, a, Spirit said he is not a divine masculine. Let me retract that statement. Okay, Spirit says thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. Um, They got clickbait, this masculine energy, but they were financially using you. So I guess they met this person online, but this person's holding them hostage and shit. Um... Yeah, because she's crazy. Irresistible temptation. And this man was financially using you and he was a mama's boy. So you divine feminine, you were taking care of a mama's boy. Okay? And now you've moved on with somebody else for some of you guys. And it, it's just like this, you're the different race and ethnicity. Okay? Then then you're probably the who oh God. I don't even know how to say this. Your divine masculine. So, for instance, if your divine masculine was this when he left, your new, I mean, your your karmic masculine was, you know, lighter skinned, or you were the opposite, or whatever. Your divine masculine is the same race as your karmic masculine. It's not okay. Thank you, spirit. But your karmic masculine was using you financially, and they were a mama's boy. Thank you, spirit. And they were the ones who abandoned you. Okay, so. Child, so what is going on? The, the bottom line, when I'm getting out of this energy, there's a crazy person in the loose. I don't know who is, like, do you have, do they, did you kick them out of your house? But they still have access some way or they're intruding or they kept a key. Did you kick a divine masculine out or they have a key or did they get a key? Child, I'm telling you, look, somebody is jealous of you. Whoever you are, divine masculine or feminine, but I'm getting a feminine, jealous of a feminine because a masculine you don't want, you that you don't want. They want to, oh, this person's crazy. And same for my men. So you got a crazy ass woman. You want to go to a divine feminine. So so for some of y'all, not all of y'all, because I am getting karmic. Because I feel like some of y'all karmic masculines think you're divine masculines and you're not. I'm just, I had spirit tell me how to say, I had to say that. So that's why I'm like, what? 
So some of y'all think y'all divine masculines, but you're still in this YOLO energy and you're still in this low vibrational salty energy and you're trying to go to a divine feminine not being healed with this crazy ass karmic bitch on your tail. You need to calm the fuck down, okay? Um, And then the masculines, the divine masculines that actually have done the work and took a leap of faith and listened to the ancestors because they realized that they were being... Yeah, they were exposed. So Divine Masculine had some type of spiritual awakening. This other karmic energy is fucking mad and hostile and everything. She's a, Yeah, she's unstable and very salty, okay? Now, there's something about doing at work. What is the work? So maybe some of y'all are... I don't know. What, what's going on, Spirit? I'm sorry if I'm confusing y'all because this whole damn reading is confusing. So somebody... You might have to lawyer up for an intrusion. Maybe you are. Somebody broke in your house. Whoever broke in your house... My divine feminine is this masculine energy. And then for my masculines, it's this crazy ass divine karmic energy. They were trespassed by any means. They don't look like they would hurt a flea or a fly and all innocent and everything. But trust me, they targeted your ass. So if you got vandalized, um, that your karmic energies did it. They were they are stalking you from afar. They're crazy. They're losing it low key. And they will do anything by any means necessary to gain back control of you, divine feminine and or masculine. They are they are craving your energy. I don't know what the fuck. They it's just like a little bad child. They don't give a damn how if you give them bad attention and cuss them out. Because it's like, well, well, don't you try to get it cussed out? They're like, I don't give a fuck. I just want attention. That's that type of child. And then you got a copycat in competition with you who's a hoe. Lord, y'all got a lot going on over here. And that's trying to escape. They trying to escape this hoe. But this hoe is crazy with behavioral issues. She trying to keep them chained and tied down. And they got, they are so burdened by this. Divine Masculine is. So Divine Feminine, Divine Masculine came up. That validated what I just said. Divine Masculine, somebody tried to put you in a thirst trap. Okay, now this Divine Masculine, yeah. So there's a divine masculine out there that you got whipped back with somebody from your past possibly and they are lazy so you're taking care of this karmic energy. And so there's a yeah divine masculine who's leveled up. This divine masculine is a king and um, he's craving and wanting this divine feminine energy and then we got a karmic giving the divine feminine an evil eye but this divine masculine feels like he's in too deep so so far so the divine masculine know he kind of fucked up okay and so he's he's got to pay like he know he's fucked up and he's being smart not to lead this crazy ass lady over towards your house Others of you, they are not so smart. And since some of y'all, they are a child, I don't know, take it however it go. There is like four different scenarios in here. Jeez Louise. Whew, but whoever these energies are that are attacking you and tearing up your shit, they are lazy as fuck. That's why people don't work and don't have shit. And they only like to tear other people's stuff on up because they don't appreciate or know the value of hardworking and having things. And they mad and racist as well. Upset because... They're a bigot because you are an interracial couple. So that validates an interracial couple. Yeah, you're indifferent. Definitely. And you don't give a fuck. You're numb to the world or what people think about y'all or whatever the case may be. And yeah, so, geez, Louise, y'all be careful. Whoever got their house broken into, my God, do a police report. Child, what is going on with, yeah, these karmics are unstable and feeling left out of the cold because you left them and they see you moving forward and successful into this, like I said, they see uh, this man licking and sucking on your neck or you're doing him that way or whatever the case may be and look at you, they like, oh my God, they leaving me. Uh, and they have to, child, so now that you're being manip, oh, child, what is going on, spirit? King of, look, King, Queen of Swords. What is this? You got somebody want to make an offer because they, they're the they're broke. Somebody holding on to you, Gemini. Who you already see it? They're holding on. How does how does Gemini release this energy? Shit, that just teaches us to be careful of the energies and take our times with the people that we interact with. Because if we would have known, or anybody would have known, that these energies are interacted like this and have the nurse to be like this, why the fuck you would never be with that type of energy? But at one time, you were dark as well. And that's not to be mad or put shit on you. But 
you, it just teaches you to be wiser. And now you're more clear and you're precise and analytical about the decisions that you make before you make them and move forward, divine masculine, instead of being so lusty in this energy or deceptive. Okay, because I hear it was a one night stand turned wrong. Okay, I think I heard it man online. Yeah, now he's in regret. The divine masculine is in regret that they didn't give an equal give and take to you. And they really want to apologize to you and make an offer by they because they didn't got themselves fucked up because maybe this karmic really wants to unalive you. They try and they heavily burden. That's why they can't. Child, this is too much. Like, y'all think about the decisions, and this ain't for everybody, but whoever this is, and they may not even be watching, but I'm just gonna say it. Be oh my god, be careful. See, divine feminine, I feel like you're here though. Divine masculine, divine well, divine feminine, you're unbothered. Sleeping good, resting. You could be a male or a female in this divine feminine energy, just caring and loving and Divine Masculine look a little worried about something like stressed out, regret, like, damn, I really fucked it up. How do I go and apologize to my Divine Feminine? She ain't even paying me no attention right now. I got this crazy ass bitch that's salty and everything. I'm trying to escape. She probably got him locked up and chained up somewhere in the house. And I am not even speaking figuratively. I'm speaking literally. And this motherfucker probably broke out. Do y'all see the chains, right? Y'all see those chains of burdens. So she really tried to chain him to this house, but he broke free somehow. Okay, he might have literally exploded the side of the house to get, <laughs> to get out. Oh my God. Put a bomb to it. Spirit say that's the truth because this bitch was trying to kill him. Lord have mercy. Gemini, I'm going to end y'all reading right here. This is crazy as hell, but I love you and all my, y'all stay, stay, oh my God, I don't even know. Y'all already know what to do, Gemini. This divine masculine is, he's, he. I don't even know what to tell him. His ass is here right now. Oh, there's the chains right here. Okay, she really trying to chain him and, and kept the key and locked it up. Child, he like, oh my God. It's almost like one of those um misery. Remember misery when she found that rider on the side of the road from that accident and she chained him up and shit and broke his ankle so he couldn't go no damn where? This kind of feels like th she broke his ankles. Nigga, look. Okay, she done did some shit where she has bound this nigga. And this is a late child. I got to get out of here, Gemini. I love you. Bye.